I have here the Samsung Tab S6 Lite 4G version, an interesting tablet with very good specs at a very good price. And don't forget you have an S Pen and also you can use it for phone calls. And yes, you have palm, palm rejection on it. So let's um, so let's see what do we have inside the package, what are the specs, and after that, in a separate video, I will tell you um, what it can do, uh, my experience with it, and so a final review after that. This is the box. You get the tablet. You get a charger, a fast charging, a uh, fast charger. Um, you have inside of this tablet a huge battery. It has 7,040 milliamps power battery. So it will last you for hours, depending what you are doing on uh, on this tablet. Let's put it here. As I said, fast charging, 7,040 milliamps power battery, and um, this is the cable, USB Type-C. Inside of this package, we receive also, um, you have the eject pin, some instructions here, we have the S Pen, and we don't have any, uh, any earbuds or something like this. So uh, this is the S Pen. An amazing uh, amazing device very useful that's why I decided to go for this tablet tab s6 Lite. Uh, as you know I uh, previously had the Samsung tab s6 a more powerful device but I don't have it anymore so I decided to get this new released uh, uh, tablet so um, what else well it looks it looks great. You have this um, Oxford gray. It's called this uh, this uh, dark uh, metal uh, back. You have aluminium here. It's feeling very very nice. You have a single camera, by the way, but you don't buy a tablet for uh, pictures. It has uh, eight megapixel. It's a wide pixels. It's a wide uh, camera. Also on the front, you have one camera with five megapixels. You have uh, stereo speakers here on the tablet okay and another one here so you have one speaker here one here okay the on off button volume button um, volume buttons plus minus you have um, the possibility to uh, insert in it um, a full uh, a SIM card so you can use this tablet for phone calls in my um, in my opinion it's a great uh, device if you want to connect uh, a Bluetooth uh, headset to it and you want to use it for phone calls also you can insert a micro SD card in it if you want okay it has Android 10 U, uh, UI 2 version um, the screen is huge 10.4 uh, 10, uh, inches it has 467 grams it's it's quite light in my opinion it's feeling nice when you are using um, this tablet okay the CPU it's an Exynos 9611 10 nan nanometers it's a uh, it's an octa core processor so you will have four uh, cores at 2.3 gigahertz and another four cores at 1.7 gigahertz um, what about gpu well you have um, a mali g72 and also you will get inside of it 64 gigabytes internal storage but as i said you can put a micro sd card in uh, in it also, you have 4 gigabytes of RAM, enough for everything. The cameras, as I said, 8 megapixels and front 5. Um, you can connect it to Wi-Fi using protocols A, B, G, N, A, C. So you will have super fast uh, speeds. Also, it's capable for uh, Wi-Fi direct and hotspot. You will have, as I said, USB Type-C here. To, to charge it 
it has accelerometer, gyroscope, proximity sensor, fast charging at 15 watts and the beauty for this price, this good price, um, almost half uh, from what you would pay for a Samsung Tab S6, the premium version, you will get this, uh, this S Pen. It has palm rejection, if you want to know this. Basically, you can um, you can put your uh, you can rest your uh, your palm here. Yes, it has. It has palm rejection, as I said. So you can rest your uh, your palm here, as I said previously. Another great uh, another great feature. Um, you will have all the benefits from an S Pen. So when you are pressing this button on the S Pen, you will get these uh, utilities. Uh, I may call it. I may call them, and you can take all the advantage uh, offered by uh, this S Pen. Um, it doesn't have any internal battery, it doesn't charge, it doesn't have Bluetooth like on the Tab S6, but you don't need all those features unless you want to use gestures, but I never used gestures on my Tab S6 or on Note 10 Plus, so this S Pen is fantastic. And um, the responsiveness for this S Pen is great. I don't see any difference between this and the Tab S6 that um, more advanced S Pen. Let me show you the S Pen. This is it. You have a button here for uh, all these uh, features. When you are pressing it, you will get this. So um, it's working great. Palm rejection. That's a great, great advantage. You can write or draw anything on it. I don't see any lag on uh, on it. So when you are using the S Pen, everything is smooth and fast. Look, no delay when you are using this. So great, great um, tool from my perspective. Also, I want to show you this. You can use this tablet to do phone calls, to make phone calls. So if you insert here your uh, SIM card, you will have your number inside of this and basically it's a huge phone. As you see here, I have this icon 4G uh, right here. Um, another interesting aspect and nothing, um, I may call it very useful basically, you will get Android 10 on it and the latest updates, security, uh, basically from the box, out of the box, you have Android 10 UI 2 on it. So this is it. This is the multitasking. By the way, you don't have that Samsung DeX on it. I don't know if it's important for you or not. Uh, for me, Samsung DeX, it's not so important. I had it on my Samsung Tab S6 because that tablet has the Samsung DeX. You know, when you press uh, here in uh, shortcuts here, Samsung DeX, you press the icon, you will go into that um, window aspect uh, mode of the tablet. But I never used that Samsung DeX. I used the tablet tablet like uh, like this with Android pure Android and that's it no Samsung DeX so it's not uh, a huge loss for me because it's not present here so these are the minuses compared with the Samsung Tab um, S uh, uh, Samsung Tab S6 the S Pen basically the same the same features um, on Tab 6 you you have um, a better S Pen, as I said, you have um, a better sound from my from my perspective. It's more powerful anyway. Um, what else? Well, not a huge difference from my perspective. This is it. And by the way, you can uh, you can put your S Pen here. 
let me show you something like this or uh, here on the back like this or here as I, as I see it won't fall unless you you hit it like this okay also you can put it here not the best the best uh, mode to to hold it anyway you have to well okay this is the the right place well here it's super strong and perfect as you see so you have to find this uh, this spot uh, it's very easy to put it here uh, on tab 6 you have to put it right here in that space you know it's not the the most uh, comfortable way to put the S Pen here you have to look and to search that space but as I see it here it's very fast something like this and it's strong look okay this is it I will post another video with this tablet a final review some um, tutorials and uh, some reviews with the S Pen and for now this is it from my perspective the best choice at this moment if you want a tablet and if you want something premium because this tablet it's a premium uh, premium tablet and uh, a powerful one with this unique and most impressive tool on the market this S Pen